Hello YouTube channel for N7LGN Radio Club. This is N7MKY David and I'm going to do a quick tutorial on how to install Droidstar on an iPhone or iOS compatible device. Simply go to the App Store and search for Test Flight. Once you have found Test Flight, you will simply install Test Flight. Depending on your cell phone connection and or your internet connection, this may take a few seconds or it may take a few minutes. But once you get the open, simply open it, allow Test Flight to send you notifications, and hit continue. Return back to your home screen on your device and open up a browser. That could either be Chrome or Safari. Once you have your browser open, simply go to Google and type in Droidstar iOS. You'll see the first link with the Apple logo and join the Droidstar Beta Test Flight Apple. Click on the link. It will give you all the information about the application. Simply hit accept for rating it until you've played with it. Hit not now and simply click on install. Again, this might take you a few minutes or a few seconds based on your internet speed. But once it's installed, you'll simply click on open. Hopefully this won't take much longer. Once you click on open, you'll be select seeing the screen with tabs across the top of main settings, log, hosts, and about. You can explore these screens and understand them at possibly a later date. If you need more explanation, please feel free to reach out to me. Under settings, simply enter your call sign and your DMR ID that you obtained from radioid.net. There are some other sections that you can fill out with regards to your latitude, longitude, location, and the description. One other piece of device would be able to enable TX toggle mode. This will allow you to press and hold versus just turning it on and off. Once you have your call sign and your DMR ID plugged in, simply go to the main setting and your mode for our reflector will be under YSF. Click on hosts and you'll see a myriad of hosts that you can connect to and have fun all across the internet. For our particular case, we were looking for US. As you can see, this is quite an extensive list. Almost there. So under U.S., our room for our radio club is listed under us.n7lgn-radio. Simply select that and hit connect. Droidstar is going to ask if you'd like to give it access to your microphone. Yes, you do. Hit OK. Now, simply hold and press the TX button when you want to transmit, and release when you're finished transmitting. If there's anybody else in the room, you'll be able to hear them and be able to respond to them. N7MKY radio test, N7MKY radio test. As you could see, 
I enabled the wrong mode, so I'm going back to settings and turning off enable TX toggle mode and going back to my main screen. And now when I press and hold the TX, it will transmit when I, un when I release it, it will no longer be transmitting. N7MKY radio test, N7MKY radio test. And that is all there is to it. If you're an Android user, simply go to the Google Play Store and look for DroidStar. Once you find it, install it and go through the setting screens and you'll be able to then access the digital side of ham radio without any issues or having to buy a radio at this point. Further demonstration would be to go to americalink.room uh, and that would be under US as well. And if I hit connect, I'm connected. And this channel is very, very popular. You could actually make quite a few contacts around the world. But hopefully this video helps. If you have any other questions, feel free to contact me in 7MKY.